Look, before the food turned off, this second oh. milkshake would have been a good idea. <laughs> now the food's turned off, this milkshake is a terrible idea. This content is brought to you in association with my buddies over at Jam Jam Cards UK. You can find the links to the eBay store and the Facebook page in the description. So it is our last event for November. We've only got one more left before the end of the year as well, which will be at Northampton Minus Crew. So we are getting ready for a regional tomorrow in Canterbury. I signed up and agreed to this before I realized how fucking far that journey is. Feels a little bit further than I'd like to really travel, but here we are. Now I've given up on PK, if you can't tell already by this one. Deck really hasn't meshed very well with me, but instead we're gonna go ahead and go and play something a little bit more fun, a little bit more helmet. Just strap that helmet on, go absolutely ham, and just dig out Grand Marju and just slap some people around a bit and probably ruin a few days as well. So I managed to get some time in for a bit of play testing with the lads and what have you, and uh, yeah, just get ourselves ready for the regional. So Jam has just picked me up. I'm now at Jam Towers. Uh, we are picking up a bag, I guess, with some stuff in it, talking some shit and obviously all very tired. Uh, I think we're gonna pick up a couple of the guys as well on the way, maybe Capoli and, and Daniel, we'll see. Um, yeah, I think that that's what's happening. Then we're on our long last journey to the regional. Uh, we built the deck again last minute last night. Um, so I'm trying to like read through cards and getting on like a Nexus to try and get some play testing in to get some ideas. But we're not too bothered about the regional anyway. We're not too bothered about doing insane or anything like that. We're just there for a bit of fun. And for content, obviously, but we'll see. I mean, maybe we ruin a couple of people's days along the way. How many extra patties did you get this time? Just one. Just one. Let's see it. What did he get? Whoa, look at that. Look at that. It's not as heinous as I was expecting, but I guess no. it'll do. <laughs> Straight into the beat roll. This backwater savage over here is eating his yogurt with a lid not even like a hard lid like one of them plasticky ones he did have a wooden spoon here I mean, but that wasn't good enough for him I just realized, like, this, this is also this the same guy that just went and got himself a whole carton of milk milk to drink it's a, it's a pint like what's wrong with the pint uh, the biggest issue there is that you've bought skimmed well yeah that too <laughs> not even proper milk just like Actually, that's all right. I did have skin, but I kind of like skin. It's like water. What's yeah, wrong with it's you? It's nice and thin. So. <laughs> it's thin, like your arteries are thinning. Thin my blood, isn't it? Yeah. Need more help than that. <laughs> <laughs> There's a whole lot of uh, fatty deposits to get through there. This is helping eating this fucking yogurt. Hey, this is a luxury MS yogurt. Probably costs about seven quid. So we are straight after round one. Uh, we didn't get a chance to do anything before we got here a little bit tighter and had to make a couple of changes. Uh, round one, we play against Jadol Invoked Dogmatica. Uh, we end on a draw, probably could have won it, made a couple of uh, mistakes right at the end. Um, I'd won game one and game two, he was, um, he ended up being up on light. Well, he managed to kill me and then time went as we were siding. So ended on the draw, but again, probably should have won that one. So uh, a bit unfortunate there that we didn't, uh, we didn't spot what we did wrong until afterwards, but yeah, definitely could have done better there, but one draw, so at least it's not a loss, I guess is the way to look at it. Uh, waiting for round two, and we'll see how we get on after that one. So we have round two down, we play against Joe Ray, one of the guys who goes to our locals, one of the team shift lads, so it's quite fun always playing someone you already know. 
Uh, we end on uh, a loss in there. Uh, game one, we pretty much just one punch him. I shift for him. Game one, and then just smack him. Uh, game two is a nice bit of back and forth. Uh, Droplets comes in clutch, uh, but not enough to win in the game on its own. And a couple of things happen to get the out. Uh, and then game three, we go right down to the uh, the wire, and I actually lose by decking out. But I basically have no choice. Uh, we get to the point where he's just got a Zeus on the board. I go to Alpha Bounce it, Zeus resolves, but the way it resolves means that Alpha doesn't bounce anymore, and I have the last Gren in hand. So had it resolved the other way, I win on the spot, but in my opponent it doesn't, so that's that. Uh, so we take the loss, a very, very tight game, but lots and lots of fun, really, really good match. Really enjoyed it, apologies for all the people I mean, a bit of stuff going on. So we are on the one loss and one draw for today's tournament so far. So we are round three down. We play against Dark Lords. Uh, game one, he basically ends on like Monster Pass, uh, and we proceed to just smack him pretty hard because that's what the deck does. Uh, we, I think we kill him that turn actually on my, my turn two. Um, oh no, sorry, it was turn three. He made me go first. He normal summons does nothing. I've set call by the grave, and that's it. Uh, we switch off his one that discards to draw two. He then proceeds to activate it again, paying the cost, and then loses the game pretty much from there. Uh, and in game two, uh, he decides I'm going to go second, which is great because I open all the go second cards and we just OTK. So, uh, pretty good, about 20 minutes all together. Probably about as much time spent siding and shuffling as the actual game was, but there you go. Uh, no disrespect intended, but it went uh, nice and easily by the way, so that was good. Uh, I think one of our boys has dropped already. There's a bit of a dispute as well with one of our other lads to do with people sitting at the wrong table, so who the hell knows what's going on. We got to play on tiny little tables, so that was a good laugh, but before that, the round before, I got to sit on a curvy table, so small tables are better than curvy tables. So curvy, in fact, I put my extra deck down and it just fell straight off the table, so there you go. All good fun, but we're 1 1 1 at the moment after round three, so not feeling too bad. It's okay, we still get a few more wins, we're still in a good position. And as long as the lads are playing, we're playing. The Home Brigade. Tell me how good a mood you're in. Great. My missus feels ill, so that's why I jumped. Ah, uh, that's why. Be a great boyfriend. And Pips, you just... Emotional support. I just caused some drama there. A little bit of drama. What happened? Tell me. Tell me as best you can without he didn't like. Sit in the wrong seat, but he didn't sit in the right seat. Oh, okay. It's like lost... shredding a seat. And then he lost his patch anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Savage. Okay, well, enjoy the uh, journey home and uh, getting home for dinner time. Remember to eat after the next round, right? <laughs> yeah, you're always, you'll just pass out. Someone's got to go shop. If he goes 4 0, someone's got to I've got sweeties in the car, my guy. They, don't you worry. Run, you sweeties in the car. You've got to put everything. No, 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 he can't. Every time. If he goes 5-0, he gets hungry. 5-0, I get hungry. So, ba basically, if he wins next round, I need to run to the car and get ready. Yes. Get ready. Yes, ready. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I've got a cappuccino muffin at the ready. Are we having a sugary monster? Oh. <laughs> and then he's going to die before we get home. <laughs> On the way home, he's going to pass out in the car, and I'm going to have to take the wheel. <laughs> Okay, right, yeah, I think I think we need to go in. Oh, right. See you later, boys. Have fun. All right, let's go. So we are another round down. This time we play against uh, Tri Brigade, Lyrilus, but I'm thinking about. Uh, it goes to time. We get time extension. Bit of a weird ruling with Gren. Obviously him under Chalice and stuff. Whether it's ruled the same way as Drop because the wording's a bit weird. So we had a bit of that going on, but we managed to get the win in the end anyway. So we are on two. 1-1 one, one, uh, after round four. Uh, I think one of our other guys at least is on 4-0, uh, uh, depending on how their result went. So that's another round down and we're having to get a bit creative with the approach to lighting. Uh, it's dark out here, but it's the best place to go where I can actually be heard a little bit. So uh, we play against Sky Striker, uh, we 2-0. Uh, Mystic Mine is a card and the game went first. We used Banquet of Millions. That's the second time today. It's just straight up on me again. It's ridiculous just gives that turn and then the next time you just OTK them. Um, so yeah, been really, really nice. Uh, so we are on 3-1-1 uh, with two rounds left to go, so hopefully we keep up with it. If we get two more wins, we're pretty sure we top at that point. Uh, if I lose though, I'm pretty confident we're not going. So we're, we're kind of on the bubble, shall we say. Let's see how we get on after the next two rounds. So one round left to go. Our last one has just been done. Uh, our penultimate round, shall we say. Uh, we played Bird, we lose uh, very, very narrowly. At the end, it was a nice, nice game. Uh, Good back and forth. Uh, unfortunately, just lose right at the, at the death. He did. He managed to get the uh, the one that punches directly and did like a fucking four billion attacks. So I respect that since that's my tactic today anyway. Uh, so we've got one left. Uh, we're on two losses and a draw, and the rest of our wins. So we're our last one. Uh, not enough to get in, but it'll be uh, interesting to see where we finish up. Let's say that much. So final round down. I'm still in noisy hall, hence you'll be able to hear all of this talking in the background. Uh, we win our final round, so we finish X two one. Obviously, not going to be enough to the top. 
but hopefully enough to get our invites from drop down uh, but we'll see how that goes um, still a really good result in the end, much better than I'd hoped for because I was playing the deck that I thought was fun. And maybe that lack of pressure is what's led me to at least a decent finish, I think. Not enough to get in, but a much better finish than I would probably have expected at most regionals. So, doing good. I think one or two of our boys may have topped. I haven't caught up on their results yet. I need to go speak to them. But fingers crossed, it's all good results across the board. This man, hoping, hoping. We think we've got at least three tops from our locals. Our local boys, Mr. Yellow Puffer Jacket, the emo mumble rapper over there, super agent, and some guy with a funny hat over there. So fingers crossed we got three in. Chalk obviously disappointed as normal. Surprise. Hopefully he can get some lessons off that guy from Leicester. We'll show him how to play. Let's see it. Wow. Take a seat. Maybe even four, not three, four. Chalk didn't let us down. Those lessons from Leicester are paying off. Hey! We got two boys up here, and we got fucking Puffer Jacker over here, and we got Super Agent. That guy's got a whole swag fucking bag going on. You got second place, and you got third place surprises. Come with our old switcheroo. Here's where he gets dead packs now. Now that they've had to swap them. <laughs> that guy coming in like, why can't I hold all these lines? Good job, good job. He's dedicating all of this to me and my hard work. You just want to take some stuff off my hands. Keep them out. Chalk, how have the uh, lessons from Leicester paid off? Are you feeling good? Say again. You feel like you've achieved something after Leicester? Yeah, Learn something. I have, I, yeah, I have. There's this one guy. Uh, he, he was like, uh, we're going to go in places. Uh, yeah, I've topped the region, so I've, I've gone places. Like All this. under his influence, I might add. Good job. Well done. Look at this hat. Look at this uh, hat. I hate older guys. <laughs> Good job, guys. Some mad looking stuff on here. Three boys, some in the corner. More have gone out for a walk waiting to come in. This food looks good. Yo, what is this absolute? It's a cash brown, all kinds. This man over here with poutine. Looking like good food, good food, good stuff. They haven't got no food yet. Sad boys in the corner. <laughs> We've all finished and these boys have finally just got their food. Sad times. Finally, we're off now. Yeah, we're finished, mate. We'll, uh, we'll see you when we get back, yeah? <laughs> <laughs>
Before the food turned off, this second milkshake was a terrible idea. Now the food is turned off, this milkshake is a terrible idea. Scary cheese. Cheese is spicy, boys. Cheese is spicy. You want a gravy? Uh, it was Joe's like beef or something. Was this spicy as well? No, I didn't order it. That's so sad. Look how floppy it is now. Look. Just flaccid cheese. You could snort those, like. Okay. If you crush up that. It'd be like, oh, you like that South Park episode where like, they run out of KFC and Calvin snorts the KFC skin. You've got to do what you got to do, my guy. No. I reckon Broads would snort that. Broads is hard. <laughs> he loves the spice. <laughs> this is very sad, I'm going to be honest. Get, get this man a lemon. I'm not fucking Adam Flack. You're basically the same person. Free water, lemons, won't eat spicy cheese. Nah, don't do Adam Dirty like that. <laughs> spicy things. He didn't need lessons to uh, to top today either, did he? Or well, he no, wouldn't he, have done. He didn't turn up. Well, yeah, I mean, it's good enough, right? Your lessons have paid off, though. I'm proud of you. Well done. Oh, of course, yeah. How much did you have to pay him? Uh, pay him in uh, scrotum. Like scrotum tickling. Didn't pay with money, paid with the flesh. Do you want to shout him out? <laughs> you want to shout your boy out? I can't remember the guy's name. What, what did he play? He played Goki. Played Goki. Didn't play Goki, he mastered Goki. Yeah, he did. He, he balls on a connector really well. When he got knocked down, he got back up again. Never gonna keep him down. Bro, he, he, he normal sonic connector into my hand of three wagtails. He, he, and he, he literally is tub thumping. You start calling him Chumba Wumba. Can I ask him for Rocky Train? It's beautiful. Oh, no, 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 I don't kill it. I have to. That's how I, that's how I work. I kill the two. Red Rocket over here. How was your tactical shit, bro? You feel better? Oh, God, feel yeah, good. It's, it's all out. It's all out. It's all out. have anything in the pack. I know my tactics are going to be coming. Silver line. I'm fine with it. Chalk actually just pulls at every regional. Look at this guy. Chalk, you're such a stud. You pull at every regional, you pulled fucking Daniel. First it was Goki Boy. And now, now it's Prank Kids Boy. Now you just want him to top you. Oh. One time I did set side. I was like, oh, it's over for this kid. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna sack to sort of sack from there. It's over. That, and then Fizzle went prax just for free. Guess what? I'm going through all Yes. Mm, this thing's made him go down the road, turning left. And that's like him do a little circle and go back on himself then when he could have just turned right. right in the first place. It's a very good system you have for him. This place is insane though, everything's really nice around here. <coughs> Bless you. After 130 I guess you yards get to get me this nice B-roll that I'm not going to edit the audio out of because instead we'll have my monologue <laughs> at the end. <laughs> just a way to finish up. I mean, I could just show like the motorway and stuff, but that's kind of generic, right? Yeah, if someone's made it this far into the video, they definitely want to listen to my ASMR commentary as we drive through Canterbury. So that'll do. Try and make a fat sound. should have left there. No, it tells you to turn left, but if you keep going left, eventually you'll come back here, like it says, right? After 300 yeah, yards, turn left, left at the roundabout, taking no, the no, first no. exit. Mm. <coughs> a leg. You're showing more leg than me. You're showing more boob, though. <laughs> <laughs> don't, okay. wor don't worry, you got to be comfortable, mate. I'm about it. I get it. Get your bollocks mm. out in the summer. Nice bit of sideball, catch a breeze. 
It's okay. I'm testing the theory tonight. Turn left at the what, right. I'm taking up. the first exit. No. They're always out. Savage. Take the first exit. Well, this is now just boring roads, so if you're still watching and you haven't subscribed, I hate you. And if you have subscribed, smash the living hell out of Press the notification button so I can spam you with videos every week. Bye.